Yo, what's up, with y'all boys? It's your back with another video for y'all. You know my tips and tricks, helping y'all boys out in y'all adventures and where to met it. So today we're gonna learn the three best ways to level up in World of Magic. I'm telling you, look. You see this level, bro? Did not even take long to get. <clears throat> we're gonna go crazy. Teach y'all boys how to level up, and then we're gonna get out of here. Go to the intro. <laughs> First things first, you start <clears throat> in one of the beginning towns. Beginning towns include Belle Village, Riverville, Iron Port, Summer Hole. We already know that. If you watch my tutorial video, my beginner's guide. Check that out, bro. So, spawn in one of these villages, right? You in here. You're gonna walk around. First thing you do, you just start walking around. You see, you're gonna see like civilians walking around like this. These dudes are glitched. But you can see civilians walking around, walking around like that. You look for civilians with green arrows over their head. Run around town. You're gonna be level one, no levels. So they're gonna give you a little simple, like fetch quest. This dude in here got a quest for me. Simple little quest, positive starter quest, tells you to, what does he tell me to do? Give somebody a letter, right? Level one, simple little quest, 300 XP. You're gonna level up from this most likely. Oh no, 150 XP. Okay, here's a tip. So, I'm an apprentice wizard, and I'm doing a starter wizard quest. So if I'm an apprentice, if I'm not, the three ranks are apprentice wizard, novice wizard, and starter wizard. Apprentice being the highest, starter being the lowest. If you're not that rank, then you're gonna get half the XP you're supposed to get from the original quest. So, say I'm a level one, come in here, give this lady a letter. After I give it a letter, run back, right? Come tell this dude that you did it. He gonna give you XP. That starter quest. That's simple stuff. That you gonna start in your town, and you gonna do that to you about level twenty. Once you get level twenty, you become a novice wizard. And once you become a novice wizard, you get harder quests. So I'm gonna go look for a novice wizard quest, and then I'm gonna come back. Bro. All right, bro. So I found a novice wizard quest. Novice wizard, the difficulty, the difficulty is gonna raise a little bit from starter quest. So instead of doing fetch quest, you're gonna be fighting stuff now. Talk to the dude, ask him if he needs something. You know if it's a novice quest because when you're a starter wizard, the starter wizard rank is a lighter green question mark than from the novice wizard. The novice wizard is like this color green, a little more vibrant. So he's giving a thousand XP and twenty four dollars instead of what the three hundred we were supposed to get from the other one. Talk to this dude, accept it. But see, the difficulty goes up a little bit. Instead of getting a letter or delivering a letter, I'm fighting something now. So when you're a starter wizard, little, you're gonna look around your screen when you're looking for a quest, and you're gonna look for a little light blue indicator. But for a novice wizard, you know it's the dark green color. So you see the little three dots, and you're gonna run to it. So I'm about to fight three of these little bandits real quick, get my XP, and then move on to the to the apprentice quest. All right, bro, so I'm pulling up on these bandits right here. When you when you do the novice and apprentice quest, they're gonna be a little farther from town than like the starter ones. But you make you make your way there, pull up on these dudes, fight them real quick. Shouldn't be that hard. You'll be level 20, but when you're level 20, you won't, pro you probably won't run up on them like that, bro, cause they're gonna smoke your group ass. So you probably wanna, you probably want to try to take them out one by one. Or right, look, look, dude. Got another tip for you. Got another JTS tip. All right. So when you're a low level and you're trying to say those bandits are up here, right? You up here? Bandits right there. They gonna see you. They gonna, they gonna jump you, bro. They gonna jump you. You probably gonna die. Cause I got 716 health with good armor and all that. You not gonna have that. Cause you trash. You're not good. Yet. When you watch this video, you will be good. But look, look, look. Let me finish the JTS secret. You're attacking the dudes, they're attacking you. Don't try to, like, go, like, don't try to fight all three of them. I'm behind this tree. Heal up, charge. They're gonna chase you, so heal up, charge. You gotta hurry up. Shoot your magic blast, and then get back behind the tree. Another J-Shield tip. Two in one video, bro. 
two. Listen, you fighting those dudes, they not gonna get you if you just climb up this tree. All you do is climb up this tree, but you're invisible. They not like they gonna see you, they gonna know you there. But they not gonna be able to hit you. They will, but don't worry about all that. Hey, yeah, but let me tell y'all another little tip real quick while I'm on the way back to town looking for an apprentice quest, right? When you're running for these quests, like, I just went, ran over, like, what, 300 meters to go get that novice quest. And I'm going back to tell the lady that I finished it so I can, you know, get my reward. But when you're running back, there's going to be chests scattered all around, bro. There's chests scattered all around the map. And if you didn't know, chests give you XP, too. Like, look. I got... Oh wait, I'm a max level, but that was I'm done. Yeah, you get XP from uh, chess too, so when you pick up chess, you might level up from it. So make sure you grab all the chess you see. Talk to dude. Time I did it. You defeated all the dark wizards. Incredible. I can't. I didn't. I didn't ask for all that. He gave me my money. We out. Next, I'm gonna find y'all boys. Uh, an apprentice wizard quest. And I'm gonna show y'all about those. Where my water at, bro? Hold on, I need to get my water, bro. I'm a little, I'm a little parched. All right, bro. So I had to run across the map to find the freaking, freaking apprentice quest, but I found one. So I can show y'all and tell y'all about it. So look, I'm gonna give y'all another tip for levels. When you're walking around for levels, bro, and you can't find nothing, because the, the towns be dead sometimes. So when you're walking around, like, there'll be random bounty hunters and stuff out there too, but like, none of them were given apprentice quests, and that's the only one I'm looking for. But they were given a lot of novice quests. <laughs> so this dude right here, he want me to go fight some bandits. 3,000 XP, 18 bucks. Usually, I've seen apprentice quest go up to fifty dollars, so you might get fifty dollars for one, you might get eighteen bucks. It's just luck. So I mean apprentice quest, of course gonna it's gonna go up from starter, novice apprentice. Apprentice is gonna be a little harder. Instead of three you might be fighting five, but right here I'm fighting three. But the more NPCs you fight in the greater the reward, so it's just whatever you get. Also another little tip, a great place to go get quests at is the silent tower it's a really really great place because all them soldiers are always there and most of the time it's at least one of them giving a quest so if you can't find a quest and the towns are dead you can run around look for the bounty hunters on the side like on the trail you run and then you can um and then you can go to the silent tower so you never know what you're gonna find i'm gonna tear these boys up real quick Give him the work. Get it out. Get in and get out real quick, bro. That's nothing. Like that's small. Once you in apprentice, you're gonna be tearing up all the NPCs. No, no problem at all, bro. You get apprentice at level 50, right? So I didn't talk y'all boys about everything I know. I didn't talk y'all about starter quest, novice quest, apprentice quest. I ain't gonna say too much more because I've been talking y'all ears off. I'm just trying to let y'all get out of here so y'all can go ground where the magic. I'm about to get up out of here. Hope you enjoyed. Drop me a like, subscribe if you feel like it. Do whatever, bro. But uh, look forward to the next video. More tips and tricks coming for y'all, boys. I'm gonna see y'all next time. I'm out.